The plot of The Wonderful Wizard of Oz follows the story of a young girl named Dorothy who lives with her Aunt Em and Uncle Henry in a one-room house in Kansas. The joy of her life is her dog, Toto. One day, a sudden cyclone strikes, and by the time Dorothy catches Toto, she is unable to reach the storm cellar. They are still in the house when a cyclone carries it away for a long journey. When at last the house lands, Dorothy finds that she is in a beautiful land inhabited by very short, strangely dressed people. The Witch of the North informs her that she is in the land of the Munchkins, who are grateful to her for having killed the Wicked Witch of the East, the house having landed on the witch, thus freeing them. The Witch of the North gives Dorothy the silver shoes of the dead witch and advises her to go to the City of Emeralds to see the great wizard Oz, who might help her return to Kansas. The witch sends Dorothy off along the yellow brick road with a magical kiss to protect her from harm. On the long journey to the Emerald City, Dorothy and Toto are joined by the Scarecrow, who wishes he had brains, the Tin Woodman, who longs for a heart, and the Cowardly Lion, who seeks courage. They face many trials along their route but overcome them all, often because of the Scarecrow's good sense, the Tin Woodman's kindness, and the bravery of the Cowardly Lion. At last they reach the Emerald City, where Oz tells them that no favors will be granted until the Wicked Witch of the West has been killed. The companions head to the land of the Winkies, ruled by the Wicked Witch of the West. When Dorothy throws water on her after she uses her magic to snatch one of Dorothy's silver shoes, causing her to melt away. Freed from enslavement, the Winkies help find and repair Tin Woodman and Scarecrow.